pharmacist and an author uh, to uh, with a few easy to follow tips. Yes, get ready to start chewing your way to fantastic skin. We've got Jerry Tokas here. Okay, so now the, this is the best thing. You're an actual pharmacist in addition to being an author. So what you say really is true. Well, I'm a pharmacist, yes, and yes. I'm passionate about prevention right. and holistic. And when we're talking skin health, mm -hmm. there are a lot of things that we can put into our bodies that are going to reflect on the outside it's and help us have better thing. skin. Exactly. So do you want to start with uh, collagen? Yes. Yeah, so All let's right. talk about collagen. So collagen is part of your connective tissue. Okay. It gives your skin strength and support. As we get older, beyond age 20, we start to lose <laughs> collagen. Yes. Our skin gets thinner, more dry, more prone to Doesn't wrinkles. Snap back so easy. Doesn't snap back mm -hmm. so easy. And so we need to think of ways to boost collagen. Okay. So vitamin C rich foods, berries, peppers, citrus. Collagen supplements are also critical. And there's been a lot of um, innovation lately in collagen supplement technology. Now, this is called biocell collagen. Okay. And this is something you can actually find at Costco, which oh. is interesting. And you don't have to spend a fortune. I believe it's less than $20. So what's great about this is it actually gets absorbed. It's highly bioavailable, meaning it's a form of collagen your body can use okay. to help support that connective tissue. And there's been evidence to show it helps reduce fine lines, wrinkles, improve skin hydration. We love that. And here's a side benefit. It's good for your joints. So if your joint health issues, the collagen in there is also very effective at helping support your joint health. Win-win. Okay, now talk yes. to me about um, kind of a celiac disease or things where you have sensitivities. Or... So gluten sensitivity. Yeah. And that can actually manifest in a lot of different ways in mm -hmm. your body, from upset stomach and foggy head, um, gastrointestinal distress, but also skin distress. Okay. It can cause rash and breakout. So gluten is present in a lot of surprising places, salad dressings, marinades, energy bars. The mm -hmm. ones I brought today are gluten free. However, you have to read labels carefully and in it in Inevitably, people that have gluten sensitivity get gluten in their diet. It makes right. them sick. So this is something new that has come out. It's called Glutagest, and this is a patented probiotic bacteria. Okay. So it's a good bacteria that actually helps break gluten down into smaller protein components that are more easily to absorb by okay. your body. So it helps to mitigate the effects of hidden gluten in the diet. So probiotics are great, you know, in yogurt, kefir, good for immune function, gastrointestinal health, and again, new evidence on this Glutagest. Now this is at Sunrise Natural Foods. You can okay. find that at a local health food That's store. Easy. All right, exactly. so we've got less than a minute left, but you brought in some cool lycopenes and other good fats. Yeah, some, yes. some foods that can help to protect your skin from the sun's rays. Tomatoes are a rich source of lycopene and antioxidant mm -hmm. that actually gives you some natural SPF. Okay. To get the most, though, out of your, your tomato products, it's actually better to have a salsa or a cooked really? tomato product. This is the one case, really, where the cooked version gives it's you more than benefits. The fresh huh. Olives, avocado, coconut oil. Love coconut oil. Fatty acids that help reduce inflammation. Green tea, as well, helps to fight inflammation. Antioxidant, dark chocolate, seaweed snacks. <laughs> they, Marianne's they favorite. Are, <laughs> exactly. They are actually quite tasty. And also, key throughout the year is sun protection. Yes, even in the winter because you still get that UVA, UVB Absolutely, exposure. and you want to put your sunscreen on just before you go outside. Mm -hmm. I like mineral-based sunscreens okay. that don't have some of those chemical ingredients that are a cause for concern. That's zinc and titanium-based. Also, argan oil. Think about that to help to fade dark spots. We awesome. think of argan oil for our hair. It's a great right. smoothing but it's serum. it's good for skin, too. It is Excellent. fabulous for skin and wide-brim hats. If you're going yes. to the beach and hanging out in the sun, always a good idea. Sherry, thank you so much. We're going to link your information to our website, gooddaysacramento.com, so you can get some more details. Lycopenes and the salsa might be better than the straight-up tomato. Mm. Mm. You learn know, something new every day. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Cord. Well, the Sacramento Zoo, as you saw, has a new addition. We'll take a